Hi friends, how are ya? Welcome back to my channel for another vlog. I am picking up this vlog right where I ended the last one. If you missed it, Texas vlog part one should already be out. And we spent time in Houston and now we're in Austin dress shopping for my sister's wedding. And um, my family actually went to go house hunt a little bit for her. And I stayed back to get a little bit of work done and I finally have my suitcase. So it felt so nice to like shower with my products and like get a little bit ready. I did quick makeup, I'm gonna let my hair air dry. I just feel like a little, like an hour to get life back together and to start a new vlog, you know? So I am so happy you're here. Tonight, I think we might be going for burgers or pizza. TBD, every time I come home to Texas though, I eat a lot of dairy and a lot of meat, like way more than I normally do. And my stomach is feeling kind of but and I knew it would, so look what I brought. I brought me some Olipop. I also need the caffeine. I need the caffeine, and I need the prebiotics, and they are sponsoring today's vlog, which I'm so thankful because I literally bring these to Texas knowing that I'm gonna need to give my digestion a little extra love. <laughs> let's, let's listen to that pop. <laughs> this is one of my favorite flavors, strawberry vanilla. My favorite flavors are the ginger lemon, strawberry vanilla, and orange probably. They're so good. They have a ton of different flavors actually. They have a variety pack. Highly recommend trying the variety pack. The funny thing I've noticed is everybody's favorite flavor is different. I recommend trying them all. I actually have a link in a code down below where you can try, they have like a variety 12 pack and you could try that for 15% off if you use that information. As someone that like loves nutrition and studied nutrition, I cannot believe the ingredients in this. This is essentially, in my opinion, a healthier alternative to soda because it's sweet and yummy and it's fizzy and it has a little bit of caffeine. They even actually have like a root beer flavor and a cola flavor. It's actually a prebiotic drink and there's so many high quality ingredients in here. It actually has only three grams of sugar because it's primarily sweetened with cassava, but there's some ingredients in here that are really good for digestive health, like marshmallow root, slippery, elm bark, nopal cactus, cassava flower, Jerusalem artichoke, kudzu root. It's amazing. Also, <laughs> the foods that I've been eating that I mentioned, none of those foods have fiber. And this is probably TMI, but I am feeling it. <laughs> so this actually has nine grams of fiber in it. Very thankful. Hopefully this will help you know, get my digestion a little bit back on track. Also, I normally get eight hours of sleep every night. Last night I did not. So thankful for the little bit of caffeine. All in all, Olipop A satisfies a craving for me whenever I want a little treat, but B actually makes me feel good instead of feel bad, like when I have a real soda. And of course it is like gluten-free, vegan-friendly, paleo-friendly, non-GMO, actually even keto-friendly. It's it's almost everyone friendly. So thank you to Olipop for helping me survive Tex-Mex and for giving me the energy. I am saving my next two for the next two days here. Cheers to that. Um, and speaking of, I think my family should be getting back soon. And I am crossing my fingers to go to Hop Dotties tonight. I know it's a chain, but the Hop Dotties on South Congress in Austin was like my place when I went to UT and there's not one super close to me back in Pasadena. So it's like a, it's like a memory thing. And they have fries in a dedicated fryer. So I'm gonna try to convince them to go to Hop Dotties, we'll see. <laughs> Morning. It's Friday. I actually got like ready this morning. This is my first day getting ready fully in my own stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking to mom. <laughs> but we are packing up to leave this hotel. We have three dress appointments today 10, 12, and 3, right? Yeah. Um, but we do have a cooler in our car, so of course, <coughs> bring him along. My Olipop, which mom keeps calling Lollipop. <laughs> if you missed it in the last vlog, two disclaimers I want to make is one, Texas doesn't have any mask rules, but I'm gonna follow California rules since I'm a Californian, and though I'm fully vaccinated, I will be wearing masks indoors. And two, today's not about me, so I'm not gonna get any footage of Jacqueline trying on dresses or anything, but maybe I'll get like a sneaky clip of what each 
location looks like so you can at least see that so that could be fun yeah. we'll see it's gonna be it's gonna be a long day but a good day i would be up waiting for you if you had to leave i would wait a lifetime if you were at sea we are in between dress appointments one and two of the day we found a, a pizza place across the parking lot actually yeah <laughs> that has gluten for pizza how you feeling well i still like the uh dresses yesterday more oh yeah yeah but they, this one this first stop was you were least excited about yes so higher potential for the next two yes i think so i'm most excited about today the last stop is that the one where i got my dress no it's um oh so the next one's the one that i got my dress so i we went to two in houston and one was unbridled and that was something that you weren't able to go to yeah and I, the last one today is also unbridled, but they carry different designers. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yes. I'm excited to see it since I missed it. Yeah. So, I think it'll be good. I'm excited. Yay. Yes. Mom and I are splitting a gluten-free goat pizza. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Ew. So this is ours. It's gluten-free and it has mushrooms and goat cheese and arugula and olive oil and something else looks really good. Jacqueline's has chicken and red onions. <laughs> and Dad's has all the meats, right? Probably? Meat lovers. Meat lovers. Mm. Chicken and onions the way to go, though. That actually looks really good. It does look good. That'd be really good with some ranch, which I got. Mm -hmm. Where did it go? Oh, it's here. Oh, it was under my purse. I <laughs> take you there. Jacqueline said yes to the dress. How are you feeling? Feeling good. <laughs> Second, if Allie feels comfortable being on the vlog, <laughs> Allie's a part of this online friend, I hate saying it out loud, but no. online friend group and has been around for a while and found Jacqueline's dress, which is so exciting. She's adorable, loved working with you guys. You're just the sweetest. Unbridled, so right? Unbridled Austin. Unbridled here. Austin. We have been to five wedding places this weekend, and this is by far the cutest place. Oh, thank you. We even went to the place I got my dress, oh. and this is by far the cutest place. So come visit Allie. She's thank the best. You. Request her so by name. <laughs> Such a good day. You have the best brides too. Yes. She's pretty Woo. awesome. Woo. Lots of nice. today. <laughs> burger we had burgers yesterday we're having burgers today because mom loves Shake Shack Love it. and they have I've, I've mentioned this before one of the only places that has gluten-free egg-free buns which is a big deal but yeah today's a good day. good day Jacqueline found her dress shout out to Allie the sweetest human ever I love just getting to hang out with her and I love getting to meet online people in real life it makes my heart so happy how was your day dad it was awesome it was good <laughs> yes I, I, my my wallet feels a little bit lighter right now yeah. after buying that wedding dress but no it's really really cool yeah she looks beautiful in it too so she looks so pretty she yeah. was going to have beer burrows which are donkeys that bring beer at the wedding but this dress was a little over budget and she's like i love it so much i'm going to cut out the beer burrows which means she really loves it because she really wanted beer burrows at her wedding. All is good. Dress over beer. Dress over beer, that's my kind of gal. Yeah, honestly. Yeah. Cheers to that. And I'm home. I'm so happy to be home. It's pitch black outside. It's almost 10 p.m. So can't see the pool. Can't wait to see it, though. We'll see it tomorrow. Also, one of the best things about being home is my dad always has these little miniature Heath bars in bulk. <laughs> oh, no! Ten second rule. And Jacqueline and I... We went last night to go run and get waters and ibuprofen from H-E-B at the hotel and we were coming back up and in the trash can there was a little Heath bar wrapper and I was like, oh, dad's been here. <laughs> it was like leaving a little cookie crumb trail, like Hansel and Gretel. You can always find your way back to him. Probably gonna go to bed pretty soon because I am tired and tomorrow is our one chill day at the pool at the house. We're also gonna make gluten-free tress leches because we found just egg at H-E-B and I'm just really looking forward to it. So, cheers. Mm -hmm.
Good morning. It is Saturday. Finally home. Today's the day. I'm not going to do any hair and makeup because it's going to be a super duper chill day. My grandparents are actually on their way here to have coffee with us, which is so cute. And oh my goodness, I can finally see the pool. I'll show it to you. Our, our plans today. Coffee with grandparents, pool day. We want to make the gluten-free trust lettuce as I mentioned. We want to make tortilla soup. We want to take a walk. We want to play Scrabble. Those are our plans. Also, if you missed it last time I was home, I did a house tour of my parents' newer-ish house. They've been here about a year. So I'll link that video down below if you want to see the, the house in its entirety if you missed it. But let's... Oh, it's like a resort. So over here, they have a pretty large seating area. Um, they hung a hammock since last time I was here. Grill. And then over here, this is what they just built. Let's see. They have a fire pit and some chairs. And then I'll flip you around. I know that the lighting is crazy right now. I'll flip you around and I'll show you the pool. Here's the pool. Here's the view. There's a house that's being built right there right now, but it's such a crazy view. This is what they call a faux negative edge, so the water doesn't go over the edge, but the tile kind of like fades into the water, if that makes sense. And there's a sunning deck here. So if you want to like splish splash and not fully get in the water. And then there's a full bench seat that runs along this whole side of the pool. So, so many people could just be over sitting and looking out at the view. And there's some steps and oh gosh, I can't wait to get in. It's not even like hot yet. I can't wait to get in. And then over here, these chairs, I helped my mom pick out last time I was home. We got them at Target. Um, this is going to be a fire pit that my shadow's in. They're still building it. And mom's building a garden. So those are her garden beds and they're gonna have stuff that trails up those trellises. Another trellis here. And then they just built, can you see? I'll zoom you in. That really cool mid-century pool block. They got to hide all of the pool equipment and it looks very Palm Springsy, which I think is so cute. So I guess we're gonna have a full just like pool chill day, huh? I think so. Yeah, what are you looking most for today, dad? Uh, you know, just getting to hang out with you and chilling by the pool and mm -hmm. I don't know, man, just a down day. It's, well, I don't know, it's early morning and you already leaf blowered the front yard and then you're going to go pressure wash the community tennis court, so I don't know if you're capable of a down day. Well, I, well you know, I mean, I can relax some. A little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I feel like you're an Enneagram 2, but you have a strong wing 3 whatever that means. <laughs> yeah, just trust me on that <laughs> <Okay>. one. <laughs> Grandparents just left and it is time for pool day. I don't know if, I think I mentioned this in a previous vlog that I got my dad a floating ping pong table for his birthday. So we have lots of fun things to do. He's got Justin Bieber Pandora blasting my mom's request and um, cue a very fun pool montage. Go hang out. Yeah. It is now 5 p.m. We swam. I actually did laps. I don't know if you guys know, I 
the one and only sport I did because I think it doesn't require like too much walking coordination or throwing or catching or running was swim team. My parents put me in swimming when I was very, very, very young for asthma and then I did like competitive swimming, but I stopped probably 13 and I haven't really seen them since. And so I was like, I wonder if I could still do the butterfly. I wonder if I could still do everything. And it was like doing laps and quite exhausting. And then my friend Hallie was in town. Some of you know Hallie, one of the sweetest humans ever. And she was like, oh my gosh, I'll stop by. And we had tea outside. We ate chocolate cake before we make our tres leches cake tonight. Cause it's a party when we're in Texas. And I'm thinking about jumping in one more time before we start all of our cooking. And one last thing I want to do today, hopefully, is take a nice walk around the neighborhood because the views here clearly are stunning. Even even when you're walking, it's like so fun to just, it's like a hike, but you're on a road. So it's very low impact, <laughs> a win-win. <laughs> I've officially showered off all the, the chlorine. You know what's crazy? What? Is my hair washes so much better here. And I think it's because you have a hard water filter. Oh. My hair can actually air dry here and it can't do that in California. Oh, that is so interesting. But mom has out her old recipe book. We're gonna make, um, our family favorite is tres leches. Yeah. We're gonna see if we can make it gluten free, egg free. Mm -hmm. I don't know, yeah. we'll find out. Let's try it. Okay, where's your recipe? Okay, so we're trying to make a decision here because this recipe is almost like an angel food cake where you separate the egg whites and you beat them to stiff peaks. So our two options is either do that with aquafaba, which is the, the liquid. I feel like I'm on Taste Made again. <laughs> I yeah. used aquafaba do so it. many times on Taste Made. We've missed you on Taste Made. I know, I've missed Bring me on Taste Made. They just ghosted me. <laughs> you can use the liquid from this to, to make stiff peaks. So we can try that and try the just eggs as the yolks, or we can just find a regular white cake recipe, which might be more fail safe, okay. and use the just eggs and then pour just the, the tres leches yeah. over top of regular cake. What, okay. are you, what are you feeling? I'm thinking regular cake. I feel like that's that's yeah. less room for error. It is. And our okay. fonza bean and the cake just it's not something. You probably wouldn't know. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's do that. Also, these expired a year uh, and a half ago. <laughs> that decides. <laughs> so we follow the recipe. Y'all know how I feel about following recipes. I usually not good at it. And this is like a very thick cake batter. And we actually, I added extra milk because it was like, it was like dough. It was like bread dough. So that's what it looks like. A little bit apprehensive, but we'll see how it turns out. I'll put it, put it in the pan and bake it. And dad and I are gonna run to H-E-B because H-E-B, I saw this on Instagram, they have butter tortilla candles now. And they were sold out of the other location we went to, but my best friend Hallie um, was just there and said that they have them, so. Wanna be free of this heart. <laughs> Wanna feel your arms around me? I need you more, need you here more than I would like to admit. Let's forget about tomorrow. Yeah, should I hide away forever? Should I close my? So it's getting very dark in here, but we um found the candle at H-E-B and I've had multiple people DM me saying they've been going around to all their H-E-Bs and can't, and can't find it. It's funny, it smells like a, like a movie theater, <laughs> like, like buttered popcorn, but kind of also delicious at the same time. And I was nervous about our cakes, but mom has pulled them out when we were gone. They look okay. Do you think that it's kind of, did they feel okay when you were taking them out? Yeah, yeah, but they're so short that I went ahead and layered it. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. Do you want me to stab it? And I just, do you want me to show you what the I skewer, do? Skewer, right? Yeah, and you use the circular. Yeah. And you just. As many holes as you can, really. All right. <laughs> to be able to fully saturate. Yeah, this doesn't feel too, I thought it was gonna feel super dense. It definitely feels like, kind of like sticky. Yeah. You know? Spongy. Spongy. Okay. Yeah. Spongy's good. Mm, it's gonna be good. Mom just made homemade whipped cream to frost this. Ooh, this is gonna be good. Mom just beat me by 10 points in Scrabble. Dad had 78 points. I had 177 and Mom had 187. Yes, I did. She's very competitive, as am I. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> and it's time to try the dressed leches. Dad's afraid to try it. He's like, do you want me to try it on the vlog? Because it's vegan, gluten-free. And I was like, no, 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 it's real dairy. And he's like, okay. Yeah, cut into that bad boy. I, oh, it How's cuts, the consistency feel? Cuts well. Really? Mm-hmm. Okay. I just want a little bit because we already had cake today. <laughs> <laughs> and last night <laughs> dad's looking <laughs> the consistency looks pretty bad kind of looks like someone already chewed it and spit it out <laughs> smells delicious it smells like condensed milk so oh no it's not good. No. Oh no, really? <laughs> it's not good. Oh no. The consistency is so bad. After all that, really? <laughs> I think I'm gonna have an Olipop for dessert. Yeah. That being said, I'm gonna end the vlog on this note. <laughs> and speaking of Olipop, thanks again to Olipop for sponsoring this vlog. <laughs> I will have all of the information and the discount code in my link down in the description below. Do you guys wanna say bye to the vlog? Okay. You wanna say bye to the vlog? All right, good night or goodbye. Good night, goodbye. We yes, love you. Yes, yes. And I'm just so grateful I did not have to eat any of that stuff. So it's actually leaving life a is good. really bad taste in my mouth. So, got out of the Better that you one. than I. <laughs> we love y'all. Bye. So, give me a sign. Give me a sign. Oh, give me a sign. Baby, give me a sign. Just give me one more. Talking to you. Talking to you. Here we go again. Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me.